Fighters Rep 5, Unified Strikers, Saturday, February 2nd at the Ames Sportsplex in Seal Beach, California. Tickets now on sale at fightersrep.com. Ladies and gentlemen of Knucklehead Nation, I'm here with Ivan Beltran, uh, who's gonna fight this Saturday on the Fighters Rep 5 Unified Strikers card. Um, so before we get into the fight talk, Ivan, uh, I wanted to ask you a question so like the fans could get to know you a little more. Uh, how did you get into martial arts and what fighting discipline did you first start out at? So I first got into mar martial arts because uh, my father put me in the gym. He wanted me to learn how to throw hands and box. So that's basically what I started with, uh, boxing and Muay Thai. And then slowly uh, moved on to some wrestling and some Jiu Jitsu. But my, I, I like stand up a lot better. And did you start at this gym here? Or? Uh, no, we didn't start at this gym. I didn't start at this gym. The last gym, the gym I started at closed down because we had some financial issues. But you know, we, I kept going with the flow. I kept training and stuff. You know, uh, figured a way out to keep training. Okay, cool. And uh, how long have you been training since you started? I would say like about a year or two. About a year or two. Okay. Uh, this is this Saturday will be your first uh, Muay Thai fight. So how are you feeling? Uh, for your first Muay Thai fight? Well, I'm feeling I'm and ready to go. Uh, I wanted to start with a Muay Thai fight at, at first. Uh, didn't get the opportunity to, but you know what? My opportunity is here, let's get this dub. Yeah, so what can the fans expect uh, this Saturday? They can, they can expect the full fight, you know? Hands, feet, knees, whatever. Uh, I'm sure my opponent's tough, just like I'm tough. We're both gonna go at it, and we'll see who's the better, who's the better fighter. Yeah. So, come. You've had three MMA fights. Uh, this is your first Muay Thai fight. Like I just uh, stated, do you feel less banged up compared to when you were training for MMA fights, or do you feel about the same? I feel. I would say I feel less banged up, uh, and especially because I can just focus on uh, less things. I don't have to worry about wrestling and the jiu jitsu. I just have to uh, focus on the kicks, the knees. Uh, and the hands. Yeah, just striking, right? Yep. Yeah, I feel like that's where you get more banged up, right? Like wrestling, jujitsu, or like yeah, the you grappling. Yeah, back pain. Maybe you might, might blow out your back or something. Uh, you might take a, uh, you might get taken down really bad, or just mess up your hand or whatever when you when you're counting. Uh, yeah, definitely, I agree with that. So you've obviously this isn't your first fight. Uh, still fighting amateur, but you obviously, I'm assuming you feel, well, let me ask you something. Do you have jitters before the fight? Do I you feel nervous? I, I would say I get anxious, but it's, nor it's normal. I would say it's normal because you know that you're going to go in there inside a ring or an octagon, uh, and that guy, you're, you're going to fight. He's going to try to kill you, and you got to try to kill him, you know? So both you guys are going to get down. You guys are going to put uh, your strongest efforts, so you, you know you're gonna have to scrap, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you just said that you do feel anxious before the fight and you said it's normal. I would agree that it is normal. But what do you have any rituals or do you do anything uh, to kind of get those jitters out? And if so, like, what is it? Yeah, so me and my team, uh, we, form, we make a prayer uh, because uh, God gave us the opportunity to fight and he's given us these skills. And, you know, he allows us to keep practicing and using our bodies and work them out. So that's one, that's part of the ritual. We all get together, you know, we, we focus. Uh, we also do this thing where uh, we send memes to each other before the fight because you don't want to be too focused and you don't want to get too into your head yeah. that you start overthinking things. So yeah. you start uh, looking at memes or whatever, start laughing, and that, that usually helps. Yeah, definitely. I would assume that it does. You know, it's always good to laugh, especially, you know, when you're, uh, like you said, feeling anxious or nervous. Laugh is the best medicine, you know? Yeah, exactly. Right on. Uh, so is this, do you do this like right before you're about uh, like, I guess fight day or like days before, week, so, week of? Cause so, we, this is fight week. Okay, so uh, fight week, I try to stay, stay focused, you know? I try to feel like I have to center myself, center my mind, be one with myself. And like, I try to relax my breathing a lot on a daily basis. Uh, and then the day of, of the fight, we do the prayer and uh, we also do the memes. Okay, cool. And kind of like just to follow up with uh, uh, what you just talked about, uh, do you try to visualize your uh, visualize the fight as uh, as much as possible, or do you kind of 
try to think as little as do you try not to think about the fight um, just like, so you won't get nervous i feel like uh since i'm running on a busy schedule sometimes like kind of forget i have to fight you know i'm at work and i'm like oh like you know like, like i gotta start working and hustling and stuff i'm at school gotta get things down so uh sometimes i just kind of forget about it but then like every day every night before i go to school i do envision it i do envision i try my best to envision success because if you can if you can believe it you can see it uh it's possible you know if you're dreaming about it it's possible you just gotta uh work hard put in your best efforts yeah, definitely. So, how's your uh, what? What's the? Uh, you go ahead and uh, let the people know what weight class you're fighting at. So I'm waiting at. Uh, I'm fighting at 147. I'm doing about like a eight to eight to seven pound weight cut, which isn't honestly that bad. So things so, are looking good. So what? Like you said, seven to eight pound weight cut. So what do you walk around at? Like maybe 155. Uh, I walk around like uh, 156. 156. 155, 156 around there. Okay. And how are you doing with your the weight right now? Right now, um. Like I said, I, I need to cut uh, like seven pounds. Yeah, so yeah. I'm like at 156, 157. Okay, so do you do that like two days before or maybe uh, a day before weigh-in? How do you... The weight cut? Yeah, weight so cut. So today is fight camp. Like today's fight camp started. We usually do it a week before the fights. So we can have enough time to uh, cut weight and we don't feel so dra drained and tired the day of the fight. Okay, definitely. I. Okay, yeah. Uh, anything else you wanted to tell people? Maybe uh, you know where they could reach you on social media, gain your followers up. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, so I do have an Instagram. I'm trying to get back on there somehow. Eventually, I'll get on there. But uh, my username is i i v v a a n n seven ten. You can go ahead and follow me on Instagram or add me on Snapchat. I do also have Twitter, but I don't really use it. You know, uh, I've got the Twitter fingers like a lot of people I know do. Yeah. Okay. Uh, you know, just hope to see y'all there at my fight. Come on and support. It's gonna be a good, there's gonna be lots of amazing fights there. My whole team's gonna be there if I start mafia. Let's get it.